Live from the ABC7 Broadcast Center, this is ABC7 News at 11 on your side. We begin at 11 with a community coming together to mourn and honor a Maryland grandmother murdered on her front lawn. 67-year-old Lily Morris was found stabbed Monday in Jefferson. And tonight a vigil was held for Morris at Brunswick High School where she worked as a teacher's aide. Josie Sturman is at the school to show us how Morris is being remembered tonight. Josie. Well, Scott, this school is what connected Lily Morris to so many people. She was a teacher's aide inside the classrooms here and a surrogate mom to people outside of the school as well. That's why organizers tell me this event tonight, this vigil, was exactly the kind of send off that she deserved. That like me. With songs and candlelight, through tears and shared memories, family and people who felt like family remembered Lily Morris. She helped pretty much raise everyone around here. And tonight, this crowd raised up the spirit of the woman they knew as Belle, a community mom honored at a place that felt like home, Brunswick High School, where she worked for years. It broke our hearts to lose you, but you did not go alone. A part of us went with you the day God called you home. Morris called home under tragic circumstances with her granddaughter accused in her killing. The focus tonight, though, on forgiveness, the way family says Lily would have wanted it. We love our granddaughter, no matter what the circumstances are. You know, we're not here to judge, and we're not going to judge. The only thing that we can do is stand by this family and pray and pray. Prayers for Morris's family breaking down in a moment of darkness, broken only by proof of the light she brought to so many lives. Do you think she's watching? Oh, yes, yes. I'm sure she's watching. She's the brightest star in the sky tonight. And family tells us that Morris's granddaughter had been dealing with mental illness. She is due on Monday for a bond review. That's one day before Lily Morris is finally laid to rest in a church not far from here in Frederick. Live in Brunswick, Josie Sturman, ABC 7 News. Scott. All right. Thank you, Josie.